In this video, I'm going to give you the top five small four bills. These bills you'll be able to dominate and you can trust me. You know how you can trust me? Do you see this creator logo on me? This is the bill creator logo. 2K has ordained me as one of the best builders in the community. Therefore, I'm verified by 2K to give you guys good builds. They do not pay me, but I can give you really good builds. Uh, no one has made more bills than I And I am a proven build creator As you see in the logo So you can trust me Anybody new watching this You can trust your boy How many YouTubers got this thing over their head Exactly Not that many Only like five or six So let me go ahead and give y'all Five small four bills That you can dominate right now with If you like the video Sub and watch the full video So you understand why I put the stats the way I do Because a lot of y'all just skip right to the build Oh I don't understand this Why would you do this instead of that when you didn't even listen to why I said it, bro. Listen and pay attention. I know TikTok fries your attention spans, but you must listen to understand the techniques, man. Let's get to it. So for the first build, we're gonna start off with actually my community build. So like I said earlier, 2K verified my build because I'm one of the better community builders in the game. You know what I'm saying? So these are all the creators right here, if you don't know. And I'm going to always pick my hybrid lockdown as a top five. Why would I not pick my one of my personal builds? You see this? Brother Jones, the most fear better go against the 2K24. It can cover every position on the floor. Will call Nightmare for Ball Analyst. Everyone must know where it is at all times. And it's complete menace on the court. Make this build now and cause chaos to the opposition. We are now the matter. Yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. So check this out, man. We got 70 driving layup, 82 dunk. 40 to get the standing dunks. We got a 72 midi to hit the midi. We got a 78 three. Um, it gives you all these badges, catch and shoot silver. All your silver is shooting enough to, to spot up. Give you free throw points. You got enough to pass reasonably. You're not a dribbler with a lock. You're a primary defender, shooter, dunker, and you pass the ball, okay? You don't be dribbling with this build. We got a high interior D. So you want some defense, there you go. You want perimeter D, there you go. Look at all that. Challenger, Holly, Clans, Fast Feet, Gold, 94, Workhorse, 91 still, Overkill, but we gonna do it. 94 block, Overkill, but if they get by you, let's swat it, out of there. Nobody finishing on you on this build. You, they can't finish on you. All right, you're all, you covered all your basics in the defense. These are the four stats that matter, and you covered it all. Nobody, not even a center, really gonna score on you like that. Um, speed 83, you fast, acceleration, strength, you have a movable enforcer and bulldozer, you know what I'm saying? And you have an 83 vert for the very high block chase down. So, Bill covers every, everything about it, and once you make it, you're gonna get the name Hybrid Lockdown Defender, the best name in the game, in my opinion, because this is my signature building. As you're gonna see right here on the screen, it's gonna say you have built Brother Jones, hybrid lockdown defender i'm always gonna put my lockdown bill first and it's small forward so it fits the theme of the video on the top five small four builds you need a lockdown make this one this next build is another one of my personal favorite it's a sharp shooting point for it all right now this build is going to be a highly offensive build able to shoot um high mid-range high three ball high playmaking enough perimeter d to slow down ball handlers some strength and ability to finish so what we're doing for first of all we have to have a 88 three-pointer without 88 three-pointer you ain't getting his name all right so midi gonna be a 92 uh what does 92 midi give you all these goodies go catch Dead Eye, Green Machine, all these Hall, Hall of Fame. Yeah, I'm telling you, this, this is offensive demon. Offensive demon. Uh, for ball handling, we're going with 88 also. And this is going to help us get the name. We need this to get the name. 75 speed with ball. And then we're going to do an 80. Let me see, an 80. Uh, let's do 91, actually. We're going to go 91. 91 bell out, okay? That's good, right? I know. Yeah, I like, uh, 91. So yeah, you're gonna be able to fling that rock around. You're gonna needle threader and all that. And you can add the Tyrese Halliburton pass style. It's good. That's what I recommend. Magic Johnson dribble style for the 75. Okay? You listening? All right, check this out though. He still got an 85 perimeter D. So we actually got defense. And we're gonna give him a 72 steal. 
Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. 72 still to get glove, interceptor, and right stick ripper. 85. As you're gonna see when I add the strength here. Hold on, hold on. Let me cook. Let me cook. Right there. Now we have Bulldozer, Physical Handles Hall of Fame, and a movable enforcer. And then now we also have clamps. That's gonna help out. Alright, so for stamina, we're gonna max the stamina because we need stamina. Um, I'm gonna give him enough to get the badge of silver speed booster, which is 81. That's the minimum you need. We'll give him 73 just so we can get speed booster, blow by, and fast feet all silver, which will help with the build overall. And now we're looking at the build. What about Duncan, John? Let me tell you right now, Duncan is useless. All right, Duncan is trash in this game. I will always say get the layup over the Duncan. So I would do layups over Duncan. I got a whole catalog of layup videos. I recommend you go with layup over Duncan in this game, especially because it's less expensive. You can make more well around builds without it. All right, we got a lot of points left at this point. Um, we can add a little standing dunk. A standing dunk is actually good. Actually good, and we have leftovers, so we can go ahead and add it a free throw. And yeah, if you want a 99 free throw, you can. And we, it didn't cost, it's cheap. It's cheap, you saw how cheap that way it didn't even move the overall. So if you want a 99 <laughs> free throw, you can have it. But this is valuable in rec because any, or pro-am, because anytime I get a transition foul, you're going to be shooting that free throw and you're going to hit them every time. You can get a free five to eight points off that alone a game. Plus, you have a high finishing. You're going to be driving layups a lot with Bulldozer. So it's going to compliment. Anytime they do foul you on them and ones, it's an instant and one. All right? So just stuff like that is going to help you, man. And we got extra. You know, you know what I'm saying? We got extra. So at this point, the vert really don't matter as much, but we'll add a little bit to vert. Because it was nothing else I'd really add in this scenario. You know what I'm saying? I mean, we can add it here, but don't do anything besides workhorse or something. But we need to do it like this to keep the name. So we're going to do this. And the build name should come out. Sharp shooting point forward. A rare name and a highly offensive build with some defense added to it. But it is not a lockdown. It is a offensive threat. And we have a sharp shooting point forward. Shades of... Desmond Bain, Devin Vassell, and Wally. Okay? Gee, I like that one. I know y'all should like that one. That's a highly offensive build. Can't go wrong with that one. Now, this next build is going to be Giannis Inspire. It's going to be inspired from Giannis. As you see, we're small four, 6'11", 249, 79 wingspan. So think Giannis while I'm making this build. All right? First thing first, we're going to 93 driving dunk. And we're going to do an 80 vert. And that's going to give us silver, not silver, but gold posterize. You see that? Because Giannis is a dunker, so we got to take care of the dunking first. You got to take care of the priority when you make your bills first. He's strong. We give him 92 bulldozer. All right, so he got he going to shove people out the way, and he can't be moved on defense. You see that right there? We doing good already. We're going to do a 68 speed um, because, I mean, it, it, that's about what it's going to cap out to to get all these other stats. Um, for ball handle, we're going to do 66. We're going to do a 77 on the pass accuracy and a 60 on the speed with ball. This is going to make you be able to get big driver silver, which is just enough. If you want it gold, you can buy Look at that. You can get big driver on gold. Um, standard dunk, we're going to go 81. Bow. You see that? That look good. So now you get... Uh, rise up and fast twitch bronze. Now we even gonna give him a little bit of a three. I I didn't have to do this, but we're gonna give him a little bit of a three. We're gonna start off with a 60 and 65. We'll raise it if we can later. Um, 88 interior D for the perimeter. We're gonna do 55. I know you like Giannis. You know has good perimeter D, but we can't do it all in this game, man. We're gonna do a 60 still just to give him interceptor. You know, so just to give him enough. Just to give him enough, all right? 78 block. And then we're going to do an 83 defensive rebound. All right, 83 defensive rebound is going to give him box out beast, pogo, and gold chase. So we actually can go 85. We want to give him gold box out beast. And, yeah, we can get away with it. For post, we will put the rest in post, man. We're going to do, like, 75 so we can get unpluckable. So when you're dribbling around, you actually, you know, decent. And we're gonna do some in, uh, let's say, 
driving layup. Let's see if we can get it to 80. We can get 80 and we can get fearless finisher and all that. And we can put the rest in shooting. We still got points. So now, now we got 76. We good now. Okay, so we got a little bit of extra points to work with at this point. Uh, let me see. And then in this scenario, I'll probably throw it on free throw. He can get a little bit of a free throw and call it like this. So you're going to get this Giannis build. It's kind of inspired off of Giannis. You got the same vibe. You can make him look like Giannis, but be a small forward. You know what I'm saying? If you don't want to be a power forward or you don't want to be an actual big, but you want to go against smaller matchups, this is what you do. You got James Worthy, Michael Porter Jr., and Laurie McKinnon. And you got an interior finisher. All right. Interior finisher build. Nice build. Solid all around build. We got two more. Let's get to it. This next build, we're gonna make like a LeBron feel type build, a 6'9 LeBron ish type of build, all right? A build where you can basically do it all at a tall height. So, you know what I'm saying? Be a lot faster than the other builds. So, driving dunk, we're gonna give him a 94 this one. Right? I know I always say layup over it, but this build's gonna be a dunking build. 81. Oh, hold on. Let me make him lighter. I meant to make him 187, y'all. My bad. We're gonna, we're gonna correct that live. We're gonna correct that lie. It don't change anything with this. 187, um, 70, bow, okay? Uh, so for the rest thing we're gonna do is mid-range, all right? So the mid-range gonna go all the way to like 80, 80, like 80-ish, and we cool. 80 is gonna give you the good ones. Now, we could go higher if we really wanted to. You know, some of y'all might want a high one, so you know what, we're gonna do that. So the final stat is gonna be 6'9", 187, 73 wing, all right? So 88 right there, 76. Cause I know y'all gonna want it. I know y'all gonna want it. That's why I just changed this now. Y'all gonna want this high one, all right? Especially all the new players. So 80, 75. We wanna do a 77 right here, okay? Now, if you want to be LeBron, really, really, you can make that higher. But bear with me, bear with me real quick. 85 perimeter, 85 steel. Yeah, look at it. Yeah. All right, and uh, we don't have a whole lot left. You know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna lie that. We don't have a whole lot left. I'm adding stuff now just to get fearless, clamps and all that. I'm not gonna max the strength out really. We got a little bit more, but I don't believe we're gonna have enough to put it in many places. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add it here. We're gonna do 81 standing dunk. So you actually got a good standing dunk. You'll be able to like dunk over people. And we're gonna add some post control. All right, what this post control gonna do is give you the ability to post fade. Now you got post fade phenom and all that. The only weakness is um, the defensive rebound, the block and all that, but you can't win all. You can't get it all, bro. You can't really get it all. And because we're not gonna be able to get that, I'm not gonna go for that. <laughs> Let's add it here. Hey, when in doubt, I just be added to free throw, bro. Cause y'all understand how clutch free throws be, man. It's cheap. It's like dirt cheap. So Bill gonna look like this, bro. All right, this is this is what the final Bill gonna look like. You got an 88 mid range. That's gonna give you all these badges, bro. Look at this, catch and shoot, green machine, all that stuff. You good? 76. You gonna be able to shoot because you are gonna have a good jump shot from that. Uh, 90 free throw. That's, that's overkill. You don't even need it that high. But when you go for these dunk attempts, you are gonna be getting fouled. There you go. We got a decent perimeter D still and all that. And we got contact dunks. So after you do that, I don't even know what name you're going to get. We got a wizard. Who is that wizard? Karan Butler, Paul George, and Jimmy Butler. It's a solid name. Some solid people on this list. And you are inside the arc score. W build. We got one mo. So this is going to be the last build. And really, I'm going to give y'all a few honorable mentions after this build. So make sure you keep watching. Now, the honorable mentions... Didn't make the top five, but they're going to be recommended too. You know what I'm saying? So, but first, let me get into the last build that I would actually personally recommend that made the top five. Is this all-around build. Now, I made this build at point guard, but y'all can also make it a small forward. So, I'm going to show you this. It was on one of my recent videos. I put this build and I adjusted it just a little bit due to feedback from the community. All right. So, I did 75 here. I did 91 drive and layup. The 91 drive and layup is just better, bro. Just trust me. You'll you'll learn. You'll learn. I mean, you can try that build. I gave you a build, a couple builds with dunk. I gave you like two high dunking builds. So you rather dunk do those. But this one right here, you can't go wrong either. All right. So you're gonna do 85 drive and dunk. I mean perimeter D, 
85 steel. Uh, we're gonna do an 86 speed. See that right there? This is the 71, max the stamina out. I'm gonna do just enough to get that. And then what we're gonna do this time is we're gonna actually max out interior D. Now, because we don't get block, we're gonna max out interior D so nobody can really mash you, bro. Really, hey, we ain't gotta max it, but you know, do a little bit there. Like 75 is cool. So 75 interior D, nobody's gonna be able to really mash your build. And you'll be able to have solid defense in the paint. You know what I'm saying? You gonna, when they run it in on you, you gonna, they can't really score on you. 86 speed is giving you speed booster, hyperdrive, acceleration, and all that. Um, ball handle, speed with ball, and uh, three-point, etc., and all that. So this is a solid build, man. All around, you, you're getting everything you need out this build. The free throw is lacking just a little bit. So if you don't care about interior D, you can take this down and put it in free throw if you wanted to. You know what I'm saying? We can do something like that too. This could work and you can get at least bronze free throw. You finish the build, which is what I would do, you know, and you get a good D, you get a high three ball, limitless range silver and all that. And once again, you're gonna keep getting the same three players. I don't know why I keep getting these three in every build. And you're getting a floor spacing slasher. Now I'm gonna add a few honorable mentions that didn't make it, but are still decent options. So the honorable mentions I wanted to include are in the NBA template. Now, if you just want to make an NBA player, I'm going to recommend Carmelo Anthony. Carmelo Anthony's build, I played on this personally. I actually played on it for like 10 games. It's a good build, bro. It's a good build. It's all around. It covers everything. You got a high layup, high dunk, standing can dunk. You can post fade. You can fade from midi. You can hit threes. You can dribble. You just don't have the best defense. But overall... I would recommend this build to a lot of people. A lot of people, you will be fine with it. You know what I'm saying? You see, you look all the badges you're getting, bro. You're getting a lot of badges. You can alter it around too. And this is if you just want to make an NBA inspired video. I recommend this build, bro. This build is a good build, my guy. Another one that's good is um, let me get to him. Where he at? I'm trying to find it. I'm trying to find it. Jason Tatum's isn't bad option either. Well, well balanced build. You got 84 driving layer, 80 dunk. These are cool builds you can make too, and you can't really go wrong with it. You know what I'm saying? Even this one, this Michael Porter build isn't bad. Like a lot of these aren't bad with the new updates. You can actually can pull off a lot of these builds, man. So I just want to include that too. But hopefully y'all enjoyed the video, man. Leave a like. Oh, it's Paul George. Yeah, this Paul George one ain't bad too. But hopefully y'all enjoyed the video. Leave a like, sub if you're new. The next video. I see you out there, man. Peace.